This is Terrence Andre Banks with Information Age Financial Solutions coming today talking about 401ks. Now, anybody works a job, 401k is the, the most common place that people utilize for this saving for retirement and saving for investment, especially if they're doing something in the stock market. With that being said, as my as I've done so many videos before about pensions and uh, the coming crisis that's, that's happening now, I thought it'd be a good idea just to look more into the 401ks itself especially if you're working in a company you, and you're taking on their word that this is going to perform and be the best for you. What I found is this particular website that does dives into what your 401k is and works a little bit more on your behalf. And here they, they first start off by telling you the most five common 401k mistakes. And you probably heard some of this before, but it's worth repeating. Too conservative, vacate too many bonds. The overall thumb is that you subtract from your age, then you should be in the percentage of stocks in your portfolio. But when America is living longer and evidence of higher long returns from stocks versus bonds, this framework is a bit outdated and said they raised the number to 110 or even 120. Not rebalancing. Rebalancing is basically double checking to make sure your money has the right amount in the right place. But beyond that, it's also in making sure that your investments stay in line with your long term goals. The reason why I'm looking at this website and just, again, I'm not. I'm not a financial advisor, uh, but I, I spent a lot of time in the financial aspects of working for the nonprofit and dealing with so many people dealing with their finances that trying to find something for the common person so they can be a little bit more aware, not caught at the back end when they find themselves in a Toys R Us situation where I saw people protesting about that or a company you work. You might be at a company for a while and then the company then disappears and you have all that money in the form. Okay. Or you would find out that in, uh, who was, I was reading an article about what's happened in GE. GE was a very strong company, but because their stock has dropped down dramatically in the business practices, a lot of people who had their money tied into their form plans and based on GE stock, they were caught off guard. And especially at the time when you need to be much more aware and much more, uh, understanding of what you're doing and where your money is especially if this is something for your long-term future. So this particular website, I'm going to put in a link inside the description. I'm just going over the couple of things that they're offering here. Fees. Fees is such a huge, important aspect that many people don't take enough attention to. And surprisingly, most Americans don't know much about hidden investment fees. According to Inc.com, 92% of Americans don't know what they're paying in fees, and they cost you. Bloom projects its median client over the course of 30 years, we can save them, themselves 41000 by minimizing fees. Why can such a small number have a big cost? Compounded interest. They become too aggressive, which is one of the other things that uh, which you're not really aware of in your 401k. Because when if you ever sat inside one of those 401k meetings with different colleagues at work, they just try to put something inside there just to get it going but really not aware. And if you're talking to one of the advisors there, it's more, even though they're supposed to be objective, you still get a sense that they're sensing more for the company's interests instead of just being outside of yours. So you really need to pay more attention. That's why I kind of stumbled across this uh, and I found this is looking like it's, they're going to do looking into at least giving you an objective opinion about what you actually have in. Investing in cash was one of the, uh, one of the fifth 401k five most common 401k mistakes uh, merely saving up cash may not get you there now if you're an investor with only a few short years until retirement holding part of your portfolio in cash may be a good way to meet short-term expenses but you have many years left before you need that money too much cash can be a detriment long term well possibly but again they at least mentioning some of these different things and I know there are probably other services and what I like about it is that again they're offering a service here. I'm going to click on the other link here. Um, check They check your 401k, get a free analysis of your current employer sponsored retirement plan, understand your investments at a glance, and uncover any necessary hidden fees. Put us to work. Put Bloom to work on your account for $10 per month. We'll fix your 401k by optimizing your fund choices and minimizing hidden fees. I don't like to sit back and relax aspect, but getting the free analysis and it's worth the attention to do that and see about it and look into the website itself. And if it does find it something of value, it's only going to, it costs only $10 a month. It looks like you can stop it at any time. We're creating a new way to 401k. Find out why these guys from the Midwest stuck, 
stop working for millions and start a managing 401k for the rest of us. And it's loading a video and they're talking about Bloom Clients, collective lifetime fees saved. Definitely something to pay attention to. Again, they're going back to $10 per month. Uh, employees at the top, these top clients, High Bloom, LinkedIn, Amazon, Apple, Cisco, so they bring some validity to what they're stating by some of the companies they're working for. Simply link your 401k, 403, 457 with TSP, and they can find out and at first start with a free analysis. The address here I'm looking at is it starts off with a free analysis, and if it does come to something that you can look in the work, it only costs you $10 per month. Again, since 401ks are your most people's way of how they're going to save for their retirement, it's best to know as much as you possibly can for more of an objective opinion and at least be more aware of it where you don't have to feel pressured and, and to do it at one time of year when they're coming in to talk to you about it. if you're starting the company from there or you're just looking at you know your reports to come in like most people do oh it looks good they're saying this and they and they just tell you a small percentage of fee but you don't know what's in those hidden fees this particular website is actually saying they're going to do more of that and give you much more information and we live in information age where that is extremely important again as i mentioned i'm putting the link inside the description uh, take a look at it. encourage you to be on top of what things are supposed to be for retirement, especially as we continue with the pension crisis that we're facing. And we haven't had a correction, a real market correction. This is the second longest recovery in United States history. So we're overdue. And if you can find anything about that, that at least get you better prepared for what's to come, it would only be smart. So take a look at the link that's going to be put inside the description. Uh, if you found this video being of value, please subscribe, leave some comments, take a look at your 401k, take a look at this link in the description, think about looking at the site, and until my next video, I'm out.